Sarah Vian from the Daily Mail called out Meghan's moon bump. It's the first time Meghan's moon bump has been in a newspaper. Meghan Markle is seen cradling a baby bump in the trailer for her and Prince Harry's Netflix documentary. The image believed to have been taken when she was pregnant with Lilibet shows her frolicking next to a beach. But royal watchers claim that Meghan was wearing a moon bump in the pic. Rebecca Slater on Cora said, For those of you who have questioned the use of a moon bump for Meghan's pregnancy, I would like your opinion on the photo released in conjunction with the Netflix promotion of the upcoming trashing of the royal family. She's conveniently backlit by the sun, wearing a see-through dress which interestingly is not see-through in the belly area, yet it's on a posterior, so she certainly isn't wearing pregnancy pants as they would come down much further towards the top of the thigh and around the bottom area. Makes you wonder therefore what is actually across a mid-area as to my mind that too should be see-through. Agreeing, Crystal Martin added, I've put this through every filter imaginable and the results are always the same with every single one. The bump is dark and doesn't look at all like it should. I have pictures like this of my pregnancy and they look completely different. Something is off with it, just like with both pregnancies and children. Another wrote, There's no doubt in my mind that's a moon bump. There's no weight gain in her arms or legs, she's too thin to be pregnant. Remember when she was on a fake royal tour in New York City and she was quite chunky. She was positively overweight and the sugars were saying it was because she just gave birth. How can that be when she was practically anorexic while she was pregnant? Alison Hartley commented, It took some convincing for me to believe surrogate, but unless her pregnancy pictures are doctored, that is not a normal pregnant belly. I also question if a narcissism, not to mention her age, would have allowed her to carry a baby. I mean, she'd have to go nine months without wine and pretty sure she'd view her body in a negative light. Then there's the doctors used, birth announcement confusion and no kids to be seen. Meghan Markle allegedly faked a pregnancy and many believed that she did due to several incidents many found difficult to explain. Several claims were suggesting that Meghan Markle had a surrogate and was only wearing a moon bump. Many also took it against Markle that she kept on touching a baby bump. To make the matter worse for the Duchess, there were photos when a baby bump seemed to be on different sides or even different sizes within the same day or a couple of days apart. Furthermore, Meghan's flexibility to crouch on a second trimester of pregnancy made many question her pregnancy even more. Meghan was photographed wearing a form-fitting black dress when she visited a patronage, Smartworks. In the photos, a Tommy was of moderate size. Four days later, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle visited Feed in Birkenhead Citizen Supermarket and other community groups. At the time, she sported a purple dress that was much looser around the midsection, making her stomach appear much larger than days before. Months before a due date, Prince Harry's wife visited Mayhew, an animal shelter that was one of her patronages. She crouched to pet a dog while wearing heels. Markle also stood back with ease and unassisted. Markle's photo and video crouching convinced many that she was not pregnant. Even mothers themselves couldn't believe that she just crouched with ease.